Happy Monday, y'all. I did forget to record an intro, but <laughs> if y'all are new here, my name is Kristen. I'm eBay reseller. <laughs> We're going into Goodwill. It's a little monkey. It's probably a hobbyist piece. It's a little piggy bank, and it's $3.99. And if y'all are new, I sell hard goods on eBay. This is $8.99. I think that's high for a used little teeny tiny waffle maker. $2.99. I don't know how much those little waffle makers are at the store, but I'm pretty sure $8.99 is pretty high. That's $2.99 for that little horse figurine. Look at all these glasses. The shot glasses. It's a scarecrow from like Wizard of Oz probably. There are so many mugs. The sign up above does say 99 cents. So these ones that aren't marked up here, they're going to be 99 cents. margarita glasses back there some of them are really really thin and that one's not marked either it says liquid logic on the bottom plates they have these plates with like the little face on it they remind me of those it's $3.99 <laughs> they remind me of the little things that had like metal shavings in it and you take the little magnet and you make him have hair and like a mustache. Y'all remember that? I don't know what it was called. That's what those plates remind me of. I didn't look them up. But I think it's for, you know, kids wanting to eat their food if you have a picky eater, I guess. Now, y'all know I love mugs. I've never seen it this full before. And it's $2.99 for that mug. All the clear glass. I don't know. Now, I don't know if y'all can see that sign on the top. It did say $0.99 cents for all this stuff. <laughs> Unless it's marked otherwise, I guess. Like that $2.99 mug and that plate that was $3.99 with a little face on it. That says Indian School Friends Society 2023. So many to look at. I didn't flip them all over and I didn't pick them all up, as y'all could see. It's a little leopard print one. Uh, I don't know what that is. Liquid feed? What's that? $2.99. <laughs> It is orange tag, and orange tag is 50% off. I haven't seen the color for the 75% off. I don't know if this store does it. I normally don't go to this store. Y'all know that. That plate <laughs> is $14.99. And that, somebody already took the tag off. I don't know if that's a 2 or a 3. I kind of think it's $3.99. And that little cat dish said crazy lady's cat. <laughs> I do like these, but they're really thin, almost plastic. Those are nice. Some more little breakables. It's $2.99. Little dishes over here. That $2.99 wasn't a bad price. I like these, but they're $4.99 each. I feel like that's pretty high. Maybe not, but... $2.99. It says Avon, so I wonder if you put, like, something... Like, scent beads or something in there, like potpourri, maybe. That's $6.99. And I wasn't able to post on Friday because my YouTube wouldn't even open. It was just a black screen that said YouTube on it and nothing would work. And I upload everything from my phone. So I couldn't use my computer for it. That's $7.99. The little fish plates are like the snack plates with the like little cup holders. $3.99. Some more little vases. That says Coca-Cola. I don't know what it says at the bottom. It's $2.99. But 
but I don't think that was meant to be a cup. I think it's meant to be like a vase type thing. That was a little Pyrex measuring cup. Some planters. A lot of clear glass. $2.99. Kind of looks like it would have had a lid. And that's $3.99 for that little vase. It did have some chips on it. That says Ralphie from the Christmas Story. It's $14.99. It is orange, so it'd be 50% off. I'll do some comps on it since it's never been opened. I was trying to see if I could see any damage, but I don't see any. The box is squished, but the item's pretty good. This is probably newer. And I love that movie. <laughs> I absolutely love that Christmas movie. And then when that new one came out, when they... I don't know what the new one's called, but if you want to cry, definitely watch that movie. <laughs> Two ninety nine. It is chipped on the base. I don't know if you can see it. So I didn't leave it. I didn't see any brand on it either. That was $2.99. Some fake flowers. $3.99. Teach your kid how to tie your shoe. I've tried those before, but I it just it's a lot easier if you just put the shoe in front of them and let them try that way. whole bunch of cross stitch over here but it does have a really strong smell <laughs> like that's $5.99 that one not all of them are cheap but it has a really strong smell like somebody dumped or spilled the Avon perfume you know what I'm talking about and that's $5.99 no discount polar bear they've never been opened so I don't know $5.99 that's $2.99 though but that smell, I can't do it. <laughs> I can't do the smell. They're not wet, but they, they don't smell good. That's $5.99, $2.99. So they're dusty. <laughs> and my hands smelt like it when I was done touching everything. It's $5.99. Little cats. And it says Catwoman. That one says have a mice day. <laughs> Those are cute. I probably should have done comps on some of these because I know that's a vintage Mickey 90s. It says Disney Babies on it. That one doesn't have like the cover picture, so I don't know what that one was. Some regular patterns. I always look through these. <laughs> Sometimes I pick up patterns and sometimes I don't. Just depends. That's a newer piece as well. And they want $6.99 for it. I mean, it's still cheaper than getting it from Walmart. I get it. But from a Goodwill, that's $2.99. They have like an S or like a 5. Is that a 5 on them? I don't know. Those are dirty as well. <laughs> Some footballs. And they want $5.99 for them. They need air. $5.99. I didn't pick them up only because I don't know if they have a hole in them. And they wouldn't be for resale. My kids love to play with footballs and basketballs and soccer balls. <laughs> All of them. But I didn't pick it up. Some waffle makers. This is an older one. I've never seen one like this before. I don't see the price, but look at that old plug-in. I'm too scared to plug those into my house. <laughs> I don't know if that's irrational fear, but I'm afraid it'll, like, cause a fire. Or is that just me? <laughs> that's $7.99. Like, I just... These prices... 
the lid looks, I don't know if that's the original lid. It might be, but I guess I was expecting something else. Those are $3.99. $2.99 for this one. You use them for ice cubes, I guess. I like this little tray. Or it's like a... It looks like it used to be a plate, maybe, and somebody put it in there. Or maybe it originally came like that. And it has like a little hanger on the back, like somebody was hanging it up. It's $2.99. I don't see a brand. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to think about it while I look down here. Some baskets and some for those light fixture covers. $2.99. If it was the, the Rolodex, I would have picked that up. So I have sold those pretty easily. And they weren't even new in the package. They were used. I'm going to let that ride in the buggy and we'll see. There's a vase, but $6.99. It's textured. I don't know. I'm going to leave this one. <laughs> I have some already that are similar, but they're not that design. But it's the same Japan, um, but they haven't sold. So I'm not going to pick that one up. And not for $6.99. A fishbowl, I'm assuming. I don't know what else you'd put in here. Plants, maybe. It's $8.99. But thinking about getting it. But not for resale. Because the last time I saw one of these, I kept thinking about how I should have picked it up anyway. So I'm going to pick it up and let it ride. <laughs> We're going to do some decision making at the end. I was thinking about making like a little aquascape in there. You put like the sand, a little layer of sand. And then you can put like some rocks, just a little bit. And then you plant it up. And then you can put duckweed on the top of the water. You fill it up with water. <laughs> I'm great at explaining things. And then you can put like little shrimp or snails in there. Not too much because it's a small one, but that's $5.99. $2.99. And $5.99 for that little <laughs> fake shell. <laughs> uh, my husband was talking about it the other day about Goodwill. And he was asking me if it was a nonprofit, and I was like, I'm pretty sure. <laughs> and he didn't know, so I Googled it for him. And it is, it's supposedly a nonprofit, but I don't know. Their prices don't really prove to me that it's a nonprofit. And I get that they have employees to pay for, I get it, but that's $5.99. It is an art easel. I don't know how it comes apart, though, or opens. It's got little latches. So that's how you get the top off or up. <laughs> has a handle, has some more latches on it. Looks like it might be a drawer. Maybe. We'll see. And I'm doing this all one handed so y'all can see it too without breaking it or my daughter's trying to help. So it is a drawer. I didn't open up all the way because that's good enough. <laughs> I'm not going to sell it. My daughter absolutely loves to paint, so I'm going to get it. And I do have an, an easel, but it's ginormous, and I normally use it for myself for school. I normally just take it out on the back patio, and I use it. But this one is perfect for her. So I found more things for <laughs> myself than I did for resale, but that's okay. It does have some paint on it, but hey, it's just going to get painted on again, so it's fine. It's really nice. It's a really sturdy, thick wood. Because I've seen others that they are really flimsy, really thin wood. That's $5.99. I have no clue what it's for. <laughs> Some baskets. There's a little plate inside. Oh, a little tea set. 
like a little dragon on it. A little lid and four cups. With the little case. I don't know how much it is. Six ninety nine. <laughs> We're gonna leave that. Now I know that bowl's eight ninety nine, but it's still cheaper than if I got it brand new. That's two ninety nine. Two ninety nine. And they're not matching, so I did leave those. If it was a matching set, I probably would have picked them up. That art easel though is the find of the day. <laughs> My daughter is so happy. All the little Christmas stuff over here. It's a little metal trivet. It's $2.99. It was really thin. I thought it was going to be heavier. Definitely looked hand painted. I just wanted to show you all this price. It's $20.99. <laughs> Not today, Goodwill. Not today. <laughs> a little metal, metal Santa train. For $20 from the Goodwill. So I don't know why this tray's out here. Maybe this is the tray to go back to the the bins or the trash. I don't know what they do with the stuff. It says gardening. Know-how for the 90s. Don't those look like chicken breasts? <laughs> I know it's probably a potato or sweet potato, but that's $2.99. It's a kid's book, so normally it would be $1.99 for the hardcover. And the spines, like, coming or completely gone. I want to see what year it is. It is Disney. And it does have illustrations. I'll definitely have to look this one up. Definitely older. And I like that the pages are in great condition. Besides the cover, the cover is uh, very poor. Poor condition. But we'll let it ride, and I'll do comps on it in a second before we leave. That, I think, is a transfer. Or it's six ninety nine. It kind of looks like it was a sticker. I don't know. It definitely doesn't look painted on. That's $8.99. I think it's missing the holder. You know what I'm talking about? Either like the bowl, <laughs> the dish that goes in there. And that was a really thin metal. It's $3.99. That looks like one of those coffee cup holder things. What are they called? Like, they're the tiny things that you put your coffee grounds in. <laughs> and my daughter found a Stuart Little book. So we're going to grab that, and that'll be $0.99. We're going to do the comps and I'll show you what all I pick up. All right, y'all, we are back home. I did get that art easel, <laughs> but my daughter already took it to her room. So <laughs> that's hers, but it is so nice. It is so cool. I did see, I tried to look it up to see what brand it was. I looked it up online, couldn't find anything. So I looked on Amazon because I thought maybe it was newer and they had one, but it was $69 and it looked identical to that. It had the same strap, the handle, it had the little locks on it. So I'm pretty sure it's what it is, but I got it for $5.99. I did get the book. It's Walt Disney American Folklore. It says copyright 1956. I didn't see it while I was recording, but I did see it before I bought it. And they did give it to me for $1.99 because they said it was a kid's book. And I was like, yeah, <laughs> that's fine with me. But um, the spine is like completely gone. Y'all can see that. Uh, very fragile. <laughs> Somebody did write in it. It was a gift for Christmas. Anyways, I did the comps on it, and there was one that sold with its original box. It did have its, you know, spine. <laughs> but it sold for $99 with the box. I don't have the box. I don't even have the spine. <laughs> Anyways, um, but there was other ones that were selling for $29 to $30. Some of them were $40 for this book. So, we'll see what I'll price it at. I haven't totally decided yet because it is really damaged so I was going to do some more looking at other listings just to make it fair and I do accept offers 
as long as they're not like ridiculously low. I did pick this up. It's two ninety nine. I am going to take this off. I don't think it was originally like that. And I don't know if this was even originally on there either. There's no marking. I already checked. But when I looked up this print, I just took a picture of it and like Google lensed it. And some of these are plates with this design on here. And one plate sold for $20. So that's why I picked this up. But somebody can use it as a hot plate, I guess. Or trivet. And I did get the bowl. <laughs> Even though it was $8.99. Because it'd still be cheaper than if I bought one on Amazon or at Walmart. Or at PetSmart. And I'll have to show you what I do with it. But I haven't gotten anything for it yet. That is everything that I got. I hope everyone's having a wonderful day. Great Monday. If you're watching this and it's not a Monday, I still hope you have a great day. Thank you for watching. Like and subscribe.